I just realized I had that on 20% volume the whole time. Oops. Hold on a sec. Okay, now I can turn it down. This doesn't sound much different when it's turned down. It's weird. It seems like Switch is very excited for the stream. Welcome to the, the next new stream, Final Fantasy VI. I have history with this game. It was on the dawn of emulation, actually. Rain Nero says, warning, the Chocobo has launched a Final Fantasy game on the stream. This is not a drill. After how many years? Um, looks like 12. Looks like going on 12 years. Strap in, folks. They're going to be here for a while. Um, yeah. How about we just check that real quick? How about we just check that real quick? Final Fantasy... And... I can't spell fantasy. Six. How... How long to beat? It says 30... Final Fantasy VI is about 35 hours. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Divide that by two. It, it, it's it's no earthbound. It's not short. Hopefully we can get through it. That's mostly what I was worried about, is this game is very long. Are Chocobos even allowed to play Final Fantasy games? Seems sus. It better. It better. It, Square owes me that much, at least. Making money out, off of us constantly. Roughly three months at that estimate. Oh, good! Just in time for Earthbound to take over the slot, then. We'll go right from that into the Earthbound randomizer. We'll finish this in about... Two... One... Two... Around May. Around May. Unless I feel like doing extra streams of it. Who knows? Because Stingling Ring will get taken over by Pokemon Fusion, and I don't know how long Pokemon Fusion would take. But this is your next three months. I hope you enjoy. A lot of people seem to be excited for it. I can get that off. I, ha I had to find a Final Fantasy VI-ish font. Didn't try it very hard. Let's see. I have actually two versions of Ted Wilsey Edition. Which is the version I'm using. Where's my folder at? One is for just for the music, the other one is for the game itself, because the music player messes with the game a bit. So I have to make sure which one I'm cl clicking on. What's your favorite Final Fantasy game? It would probably have to be this one. With like, 9 and 8 kind of vying for second place. I hope this captures. Yeah. I'm gonna have to de-shrink it just a little bit, though. De-stretch it. Maybe... Fit the screen. There we go. For real? That's crazy. It, well, um... My history with the game is when emulation started, my, my cousin showed me Final Fantasy VII, but I didn't get to really play it, because I couldn't go anywhere. I just... Uh, Golden Saucer, a whole bunch. And I got Final Fantasy VI. Just to find out what the hell is this Final Fantasy about. Why is there six of them? Why is only three in the United States? So I found Final Fantasy III. It was three in the US. We skipped... Real three, four, and five. Wasn't three like Onion Knight? Four was Cecil. And five was Bart's. So we skipped those, I believe. Wait. Didn't we have Bart's in the United States? By the way, we, we, we're going to be seeing this cutscene. Again. Because... Some things are unskippable in Final Fantasy VI. We got it on the GBA. Oh, okay. So we got it later. Along with this. There is a readme I need to pull up. While this is happening. Because I could do this. I could do that. Especially since we're going to be seeing that again. Alright. There we go. 
some a little bit of history behind the ROM that I'm using. Yeah, we got we got five and six on the GBA. This is kind of sort of six. It's kind of sort of six. Are they really gonna make us go through the dialogue too? I got a solution for this. It's called restart the totally legit SNES. I love Final Fantasy VI. Alright, if you enjoyed that cutscene, here it is again. I actually started the game this time. I got this game on emulated. I emulated it. I played it. And then when I got a PlayStation, I went and played seven. That's the short, short version. This is my first Final Fantasy. It's also one of my favorite Final Fantasies. I don't remember 100% what happens in it, but I do remember the important things that everybody remembers. But this is Ted Woolsey Uncensored Edition. Their goal was to make the SNES version uncut and to clean out the script, but keep the nuance that Woolsey was using in the original game. Because he had a limited time for translating, he had limited room to translate with, stuff like that. So they used the original script, the entire game was looked through line by line using 6 Advance, RPG-1, and a Lena Dark Darkstar to accomplish this. And then the game's script was heavily analyzed by Quasit and Tom Mado from Legends of Localization. The, the, the Mother 3 guy. Big Switch! I discovered there's no milk in the house to go with these cookies. Oh, hey, I actually... Oh, I don't have the progress to dialogue. I'm, I'm debating if I want to read the dialogue, because it's Final Fantasy VI. There's a lot of dialogue. There's a lot of dialogue. Let's see how it goes. So Vix is in this. Yeah, that's one of the weird translation things that happened, is v Biggs turned into Wix, or, or Vix, for a little while. Like, no, it's always Biggs and Wedge. It's tradition. It's gotta be Biggs and Wedge, and terrible things have to happen to them. So yeah, Tom Mado, Mother 3, was, was on board for this. They updated the script several times. They added a bunch of tools and patches and bug fixes, add-ons. I have like a bunch of add-ons in here. All of it to just smooth out the game and make it like the definitive Final Fantasy VI. Classic edition. I was always wondering, who the, where the hell did Vix go? Oh, and uh, one of the um, uh, long cutscene. Want to know the fun thing about this? I just mentioned add-ons. I just mentioned add-ons. You know what one of the add-ons are? Skip the cutscene. That solved that problem in a hurry. Oh, another add-on that's on here? Hold B to run. Don't tell me what to do, Wedge. I just threw Mode 7 on the ground. Mode Welcome to the year 2023. Mode 7 doesn't exist. Oh no, are we the baddies? They changed some of the names, too. I think this monster used to be called Lobo. Magic... Magic... Missile. You missed a spot. You missed a spot. I think Biggs and Wedge only has the three beams, too, and they don't really have a heal. Doggo got yeeted. They mentioned she has, like, a slave crown on. Controlling her mind. Because she annihilated, like, a ton of people. Text limits are still a thing, though. It's still SNES. 
There's no point on what beam you're going to use in this chapter. It's just like, hey, I got four different beams to shoot. They're all gonna instantly eat these guys. One of my favorite things about Final Fantasy VI is like, isn't all the enemy sprites like hand-drawn? It's like a hand-drawn pixel sprite. So there's so much more detail than the hero sprites will ever be. Look, all we wanted was an Esper. Don't make me shoot ma magic missiles at the dog. So many dogs are gonna die. I know SNES, it's supposed to be like a big turret pops out of the back. It's You're supposed to use your imagination. Big missile turret pops out of the back, shoots a missile, goes back down. I would like to think she just holds up a missile and throws it. Because that's fun. Nope, they got the dogs. Move in! The dogs wore them down. Vanisher? I don't think Katero is supposed to have this in the original game. Get banished, fool! Just... Fetus Deletus. She just Fetus Deletus. Oh, I, I do have to do some things in the configure menu. Let me save state real quick, just in case there's a bug. I don't think there's going to be a bug. I've tested it before. Banisher, in other words, later nerd button. Plot twist, she fires a missile via blue magic. I want to config a little bit here. A little bit faster speed, but very fast message. Chicken! Okay, that's a, I guess that's supposed to be a chocobo? But just chicken background. Go with this, because we're basically the pig masks right now. Dark and evil. I'm imagining a Star Trek universe now where they beam up fetuses. That is... That is, um... That is the thing that has to happen in this dark edgy Star Trek that they have now with Picard is that, hey, why don't we just abort a fetus by beaming it out of the woman's body? There's no mess, there's no fuss, it's instant. I think that's supposed to be Fat Chocobo. Where's the Demon Chocobo background that GDQ has incentives for? Could have sworn that was six. Um, maybe it's the Steam version? It might be the Steam version. I didn't play the Steam version, because it looks terrible. But you know I'm going to be using this B button run. Oh no, the doggos grew up! They evolved! Wait a second, they were on two legs before. He just summoned Critical at me. He pulled out his AK-47. And just... Vaguely threatened me. Okay, maybe it wasn't that, that big of a threat. Well, I know what I'm using against giant things now. Terra, you just basically used Napalm. How could you? Oh, wait, no, her, we don't know her name yet. Wait, um, it's, it's, um, huh? Yeah, her name is Huh. Nope, it's the only Minecraft. It might, it's only the Minecraft we could ac access. So I call dibs on the diamonds. What's that about uncensored version? Well, it's not like that. It's just that when they did the Game Boy Advance version of Ted Woolsey's um, thing that he did, is he's translating? They were a little bit um, careful with it. This was by this was by a lot of people, including Tom Ado. So Tom Ado was involved. You know it's going to be good. 
Oh wait! They don't like- they like poison! Where rats love poison! You encountered an armor chocobo. I will confuse the rat. Welcome to confuse a rat! There's a little bit of stereo too, that made my right ear tickle. Oh no, I'm confused! No! Everything on the far right is, like, tickling my ear. Stop that. Where rats? They're rats! They're castle! They're mine! What are you doing? I thought we were talking like this. No, we don't want to talk like this. Alright, I'm easy. I didn't get the quote quite right. I haven't seen that movie in a while. Maybe we should get out of our machines now that we're in the mines. You know, so we could enter the side doors and maybe the Esper's there. Big's power activates! Absolutely nobody else could have done that, Biggs. Good job. Hi! Ymir! The, the Norse god? Oh, what was this thing called before? Oh, my memory is so rusty on this game. These are late 90s Star Wars references. I think I was referencing Young Frankenstein. Yeah, the Lightning Wilk, that's what this thing was called. They gave it a name in this version. Use lightning on the lightning whelk. Got it. So whatever you do, don't attack the shell. What, what about lightning? What about lightning? Let's see what lightning does to the not shell. Bigs and wedge, I mean. I can't. I can't stop thinking about bigs and wedge without Barrett showing up to give us his advice. Something tells me I can't banish this guy, right? I can't just banish him to the ninth dimension. Which is tech we totally have? Yeah, of course not. It's death. Now, in this game, there are some enemies that... No, no, Wedge, don't do it. Biggs, don't... Oh, no. Oh, no. Biggs! How could you? He said no! You don't listen! The snail's incompatible with the Shadow Realm. It's too pure. Too good. Decisive battle theme. That's what they call it. Look, the snail's gotta be weak against fire, right? And magic missile. I know it's supposed to be Magitek missile. But I'm gonna say magic. Oh, I'm back. Hello, Silver. We just have to defeat this boss and the game is over. It's been a long 35 hour stream. No, not again. The timing is so bad. Luckily, he likes the soldiers a little bit less. It ain't over till you yeet a train. Oh, yeah. Yeah, when do we yeet? It's gotta be soon, right? It's gotta be soon that we yeet that train. Like, right after this, Biggs takes his... Aliens movie cargo loader and just flips the train over. Duplex a train. Zelpa the train? Oh no, don't do that. That's dirty. Oh my. Oh, 
Wait a second, you guys aren't... Are, are you? Wait. Are they, are they part of the rebels too? Do they want, like... Money? For whatever? Oh, well, I guess we'll never find out. Uh, SNES with its its fake 3D with the things on the roof going over your head blocking the view. Val Germanda. Oh, we get Norse up in here now. Isn't it supposed to be called Tritok in the original? Something try something. Everybody's glowing. Try talk. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I was exactly right. You know, what? I don't need the notepad up anymore. I explained what this game was. Oh no! Horrible things are happening. Bye, Biggs. It's part of the contract. You have to die now. Thanks for starting the game for us. And then she signed a pact with that demon. She's now a warlock. She can use Eldritch Blast, 1d10, with agonizing... agonizing modifier. That's all it takes. Oh, I, I, I was waiting for her to move. So, you're finally awake. You were caught in that ambush, the same as us. Final Fantasy VI and Chrono Trigger, what happy memories. Yep. That's why I did Chrono Trigger, so I had to even it out by finally doing Final Fantasy VI. It was easy to take off, it didn't have any failsafe on it or anything. The protagonist has amnesia. A mysterious young woman, enslaved by the Gestalian Empire, born with the gift of magic. She's also really good at piloting a mech. I'm not gonna mess around. Tear. Actually, I think her original name was Tina. But I'm not that much of a gatekeeper. I kind of like Terra. Well, she has to, because the plot has to continue. And how are you going to continue with a girl named Girl? The music in Final Fantasy Sex is the six. It's Final Fantasy Sex. Oh, oh my! Final Fantasy Six is the best in the series. You can't convince me otherwise. Final Fantasy Six sex has to be a thing, right? Heard of Link's Awakening? How about Terra's Slumber? I vaguely remember those things. I think I worked for those guys. No time to explain. Jump into this time portal. It's a good thing I had those sprint shoes right off the bat, huh? Oh, we, we already looked at the menu, but you can see she has her class listing on there now. She's the Sorceress. Probably Divine Soul Sorcerer. For reasons we will learn later. Darn it, stealth fail. You won't get me alive, coppers! But rebels! I'm still technically evil. Mech attack? I don't have my mech! Now what can I do? I can set you on fire, that's what I can do. 
Oh, wasn't there uh, a thing with this game that uh, you just have to hit the R1 button? Well, actually, there was only one R back then. And you could make it area of effect. But it does reduce damage. I think I both remember using that a lot. Can't believe I, I, I can't believe that I'd be doing a stream or a let's play and hearing the Final Fantasy Victory theme un unironically. I'm not quite sure why that is. I have a question though. Where do they harvest Phoenix Downs? Is there, like, a phoenix farm somewhere that's never explained in Final Fantasy? That's why it's in all the shops? Is it like the KFC ones? They clip the beaks off, they keep them in cages, they're just picking the down off them. Free the phoenixes! They don't deserve this! They can be as cruel as they want, because they can't die! You gotta do something about that. Terra becomes an environmentalist. She wants to save the phoenixes. But Big Phoenix... Big Phoenix Down says no. And then sends the clouds and the spritzers and the mechanics after you. You just pluck them clean and throw them in the fire. Terrible! Well, given that phoenixes constantly revert themselves... Um, it doesn't make it right. It doesn't make it right. It, you can't... It, it, even though it's fundamentally immortal, it doesn't make it right to abuse them like that. They probably remember their past lives, too. So those phoenixes are progressively getting pissed off. Better check yourself before they start wrecking yourself. Just saying. Just saying. Here we go. AoE fire. I like to think AoE fire is like burning hands. Just shoots it out like flamethrowers and just waves them around. Listen, those birds also solved world hunger through similar mechanics. I would just want to save the phoenixes! Leave me alone! Bottomless drumsticks and wings. You won't give that up. That's all Big Phoenix. Well, she's dead. My sweet little magic user. <laughs> With this slave crown, I practically own you. Okay, I will read Kefka lines. Come on now. I'm going to read Kefka. Kefka's amazing. And I can never do it as good as that guy in Dissidia. I like the guy in Dissidia for Kefka. Fire beam, lousy. You just use Bio Blaster, come on. <laughs> good! Burn up everything! There's sand in my boots! I don't know why it was just randomly. There's sand in my boots! I think somebody pulled the Woody button. Now, ultimate, ultimate test here. Ultimate test here. What do you see? Do you see an old man with a big Fu Manchu beard? Or do you see a dog? I will not progress the screen until I get answers on this. What do you think he looks like? This has to happen every time Final Fantasy VI happens. I'm not telling you what I see until you tell me what you see. It looks a little like Magneto. Magneto? 
really? I guess he's kind of does. If you look at it a certain way, it does look like a helmet. He looks like Stalin, but in a fancy dress and old. I, I think that's a little bit on the nose for what they were going. He's got a helmet. He looks like a dog. He looks like a dog man. He looks like a doggo boy. He's the worst good boy on the planet. You see, the bottom part of his head is the nose, and then you got the eyes, and he gets floppy ears. Bunny man with a mustache. Long live, live Emperor Banuni! He looks like my grandma, so switch. What does your grandpa look like? Oh, I had the weirdest dream. Oh, wait, no, I'm still dead. Never mind. And now the other, other protagonist. Treasure hunter and trail-worn traveler, searching the world over for relics of the past. He's an archaeologist. It's luck! Because that's what he likes to open in his spare time. A resident treasure hunter. Robbing? I think I prefer the term treasure hunting. Semantic nonsense. Like there's a difference. Yes, there is! It's called archaeology. It's a huge difference! Anyways, there's something you need me to do. I met THE girl. Oh, congratulations! You don't need the girl with the power of magic! You probably fell in a hole somewhere. Dreaming about things. Ah, the, the, the Narsh resistance is not joining up with the bigger movement. They just want... they want a scapegoat, basically. Alright, so you wanted to get me... get her out of Marsh. Marsh. Narsh! And this conscripts some Moogles, it seems. Nah, that's impossible. Their union is way too powerful. Treasure head thief. You're a thief. You can't become a coal ninja unless you embrace the thief job. Well, I need to level up thief a little bit. I mean, he does have a Naruto, Naruto headband. Bring in the two-legged, four-legged things! Underworld, there's a whole bunch of them. Wait, wait. Mogs? I'll do it for 50,000 schmeckles. This part is hard to switch. By the way, have you seen a TV commercial for Final Fantasy VI? Hilarious. Smog's voice actor does it too so well. D does he make him sound like he's from New Jersey? Because I always imagined a head mod kind of sounded like he was from New Jersey. No, I think I kind of got it. It's, it's kind of like Final Fantasy Tactics and Orc Fort Condor. Whichever way you want to think about it. I'll take point here. Actually, I think I do need that information. Um, uh, how do I switch to... Oh, there we go. Oh, wait! Lock, you're in the way! Lock, you're in the way! I thought you could just walk through your, your compadres! Moogles versus Chocobos. Well, Chocobo... Chocobos gotta win. Mog, Malulu, Mogan, Mog, Magyu One. I call him Magyu One, even though it's Magwell. I have learned to dance. Not too keen on American accents, but he acts like a movie director. 
Oh, Mog. Yeah, I can see I can see movie director for Mog. Yeah. New Jersey is uh, is a lot like what I used for um, what was his name? Lee from Eastward. Kind of sounds like Unicorns. Have Unicorns smoked? I don't know. This doesn't seem all that hard. I like that Mog's weapon. I like Mogwell's weapon. Ah, I wanted to dance, guys. Guys, I was going to do a dance! Come on! Just let me dance! Again, these things have two legs. Every single unit we fought so far only has one- Oh, Cosmog. Cosmog, get back in the bag! Damn it! We'll let that guy out of the bag. Mogwin Mogzi. That'll be a more insane battle than it sounds. Some chocobo can just just cast Meteor. Yeah, the red ones. And if we get Red Comet in here, the heck with it. Just pack it in. Just pack it in. You're not going anywhere. The Moogles might summon good King Magomag. Yeah. Yeah, if you go by Final Fantasy XIV logic, they can just do that Infinity. As long as their Mog's in jeopardy, Good King Mago Mog will be there. That's the last game in the Chocobo Mystery Dungeon series. I think it's the Everybody Remake from uh, the Switch, because I have that. I have that, it's just not downloaded anymore. I think I stopped at, like, the final dungeon, because I kind of just got tired of it. I had a scholar. Hey, we killed all your two-legged, four-legged guys! I'm gonna bring Mog over here, and he's gonna punch you in the face. I got more four-legged guys! Oh wait, no, I wanted to dance! No! Darn it! Hit him with a mace. Dance on his grave. Broke him in half! Am I mixing the name with the Pokémon one? No, it's called Chocobo Mystery Dungeon. No, you're right. It's it's Rescue Team that is the Mystery Dungeon for uh, Pokemon. Thanks, Moogles, we're in your debt. Right here. For some reason, I keep on changing accents. I'm not quite sure what to do with Lock yet. The mobile keyboard has the auto-filling letter A for Pokémon. Yeah, it does that to me, too. The Pokémon. Oh no, th now they have a side way in for the bad guys! No, they're gonna attack the town from the side now! Back with us now? You saved me! Save your thanks for the Moogles! Yep, and your paycheck. It's gonna take a little while to pay off. It's like my mind is trapped in a fog. You have amnesia? That means you're a protagonist. And said my memory will come back eventually. So you lost your memory. Don't worry, you're safe with me. I'll protect you. And then I'll steal your heart. Give you my word, I won't leave your side till your memory returns. She doesn't believe him. She gave him the, the blink from the meme. He's like, looked him over and was like, Really? You know what would be the worst thing to do in the right now? Is go back into town. 
Oh, the, the, hey, do you want more tutorial? Would you love more tutorial? There's so much tutorial in here. Isn't there, like, free stuff in here, though? You know, I'm a thief. I would love some free... This ain't free stuff! Burn it. Lock can steal. Because I think if we go into the menu... He's a thief. Nope, he's an adventurer. Come on now. He's an adventurer. What's your favorite type of game? I would say Meg uh, Metroidvanias. And... Um, I want to say JRPGs, but there's only certain JRPGs to tickle my fancy, so... It was free puppies! Terra, you just killed our free puppies! Got your sleeping bag. What are you up on the chair for? Why do you not have a sitting sprite? Don't run in a pincer attack. Fight it out. Both really good genres. Games. I'm just here to take your free stuff. I don't care about all these tutorials they're trying to tutorial at me. He will literally tell you about everything in the game. We found Lavos in the bucket. This sounds like a good idea. Maybe? Nope! Didn't see anything. Is this the pits? We better hightail it southward to Figaro. Otherwise, a guy will keep on jumping out and not chase us. Mode 7! Mode 7! I hope you love Mode 7! This... Ah, this look... Uh, ow! No, kill it! Dead. It's got teeth a mile wide, it's a killer! Guys, I'm just trying to practice my protagonist privilege. He, he's an, a, a thief venturer. Thief venturer. He is THE adventurer. It's kind of what he does. It's his thing. On, on the way to meet the early game carry, commonly known as King Edgar. Early game carry? He's gonna be in the party as often as I can. I like Edgar. Edgar's the artificer. And his weapons are broken. And he has a good stat spread. They really loved Edgar. Even though I mentioned the naming convention to uh, my cousin once, and they actually put the, the, the name in the game as uh, whatever you named them, and he wanted to call him Macaroni Figaro. Except Chainsaw. Uh, yeah, right, Chainsaw. Whatever you need, he's got it in his machines, eventually. He's an adventurer and subclassing in Thief. Yeah, Locke is like maybe... What is he, level 5 right now? He's, he's probably like 3 fighter, 2 rogue. One thing I kind of wish they did have in the add-ons is something to do with the encounter rate. Because the encounter rate could still get a little silly. speedrunners have all hashed this out already. Poisona! Not just poison! Poisona! Okay, this looks like a Figaro. Oh! Actually wanted to go around the castle. I wanted to talk to the Chocobos. Oh, it's you. Proceed. Why? Block, do you know the people here? Oh, 
welcome to the desert castle. Engine room. For a castle? I wanted to see the engine. What kind of things secrets are you hiding in here? Talk to the Chocobos, they're just gonna say, you know, I wanted to tr you, you failed to teach Chocobos English. Okay, let me think, let me say this another way. You failed to teach English to the Chocobos 100% of the time that you don't try to teach English to, okay, I, I ruined it. You gotta try once in a while. Maybe you'll be lucky. It's about 10,000 chocobos in the world that know English. Or some other human language. You'll find one eventually. I wonder what I could loot in here. Also, another big debate. Is it Kui or is it Quay? Something tells me I shouldn't buy off you just yet. I don't know, ancient knowledge from like 20 years ago. Auto crossbow, noise blaster, bio blaster, we don't know any of these things. I don't understand your crazy artificer talk. Any free stuff in here? No. Free stuff in here? No. Free stuff? Free stuff! Ah. It's more of that cruelty down. Can't stand that stuff. What about you, Terra? What do you feel about the cruelty to the phoenixes? I have it all in my brochure. Look at him, he's wearing the Uwu Senpai Swagman Sephiroth XX clothing. I mean, this young woman is... Who do you think you are? Oh, my apologies. I am known as William! No, wait, how rude of me to turn my back to a lady? I already heard it is, it's Quay rhyming with me. Quay. The young king of Figaro Castle, allied to the Empire, and a master designer of machinery. He's an artificer. Macaroni. can make his name Macaroni. I am Edgar, King of Figaro. I surprised someone like me knows a king. Yep, 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 yep. There's still weird quirks to this game even when it's translated, like why were they nodding at each other so much? So, you're an Imperial soldier, right? No problem. You're gonna win the Empire our allies. Please relax while you're here, it's not in my blood to harm a lady. Let's get a little rough in the bedroom. It's because of my abilities? I'll give you three reasons. First of all, your beauty has captivated me. Second, I'm dying to know if I'm your type. I guess your abilities would be distant third. He's a ladies' man. He's a womanizer. He's got high charisma. Guess my technique's getting a little rusty. And yeah, Tara, what's wrong with you? Why ain't you going after every man you meet? Like, like normal women do, right? They would just be throwing themselves at Edgar. What's wrong with you, Terra? This is the 90s! Supposed to be like Dracula dead and loving it. 
No, wait, no, that wasn't Dracula Dead and Living It. That was History of the World Part 1. When somebody was posing as, um, King Louis the Fourteenth. Oh, wait, that, 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 do we get a shop discount now? Ladies get the shop for free? No, that still looks like it's the same price. I could have sworn it was like a, a discount. I took the vices. Ah, man. So close to cracking the truth. The secret is we're all... We're all uh, patronized by Big Phoenix. To keep their secrets. The Magi. There's one thing to be said about Final Fantasies in general, is in so a lot of places, they don't have an original bone in their body. I see, talking Chocobo, he's telling us this. But I tell ya. He told us this is the castle. Oh, they trained all their Chocobos to say that. Darn it. So close. One in ten thousand chance, and I blew it twice. They manufacture weapons here, too? Why is this not on the Empire's hit list? Because that seems problematic. Someone's gonna pull a Lando Calrissian. One hour in. We already have Edgar. Now we got bitten by bunnies, we need to sleep. We got bit by a bunny. Time to take a nap for eight hours. Try not to cry. No woman is safe from Kid Edgar. Kid Edgar. King, King Edgar. What? Yeah, that, that's him. Yep. It's the 90s! So I'm just gonna leave off on my own some of uh, the brick castle you got there. I'm just gonna head out into the desert. Maybe not die. I actually forgot um, where I have to do in this part. Like, where to peck the day go? And you're just kind of pieced and lock and pieced. Everybody's gone. They're not shopping. Probably the, en the engine room? No, you can't go in the engine room! Get him away from that switch. Oh, hey, we could go to jail. Oh, Wolf the pickpocket. You see, this is one thing that Final Fantasy doesn't really do anymore. They don't have... ...basically furries. Sure, maybe Final Fantasy has like one race that's basically furries. But this, they're just like everywhere. They're just hanging out, they're in jail. Rightfully so. Can anybody give me directions? I'm lost in the castle. Yeah, that's great. I 
I talked to everybody and I still don't have hints. The guy has a twin brother, you know? He was such a nice boy, always thinking of his family. Now that looks like a guy that would suplex a train as soon as he gets the chance. So this talk of a successor. Are you blind? Look how thin his face has become. I don't know, the Sabin and Surfer just seems to kind of work. Even though he's supposed to be Kung Fu Monk Man. Oh wait, we don't know it's Sabin yet. Hold on, the game has to tell us. Edgar's twin brother, who traded the throne for his own freedom. And huge pectorals! Sabin! His name is Sabin! Oh, he looked just like his father. When he ran away, he was a sweet little child. I wonder what he's like now. A guy that suplexes dreams. I guess we had to get introduced to Sabin before we could continue. They should have came here first if you're giving people weapons. Come on. Dumbest bad guys on the planet. He didn't get the throne, so he got ripped. Now he wins the crown in all the bodybuilding competitions. You're new. The whole business of the succession was so repugnant to Sabin, the kid break king's brother. He fled the castle forever. The succession was settled with a coin toss. That doesn't seem like a great way to run your kingdom. Ah, yeah, he's back. Well, how did you like my castle? You want to talk about your weapons trade? How about the Kefka? Oh boy, here he comes! It's that boy! Hui! Emperor Gestalt's stupid orders! Edgar, you pinhead! Why do you have to live in the middle of the stinking desert? These are recon jobs at the pits! Ah, there's sand in my boots! Oh, so that's where that line came from. Now comb the desert! Idiots. Got the sand in my boots in the middle of the desert, stupid. Out of my way! They just ties in each other up because I forgot that I can move Edgar. What do you want? I thought we were allies. What are you doing in my domain? Pathetic sand country? Rude. You've been busy down south, looking for more cities to destroy. Heck with you. What brings Kefka, loyal court mage of Emperor Gestal, to my humble castle? I'm so worried that there's sand on my boots! A girl of no importance has recently escaped from us. We heard she found a refuge here. This doesn't have to do anything with that. Which everybody's been whispering about, would it? Lies! She merely stole something of minor value. Is she here? That's a tough one. That guy's gotta go. Later, Silver. You see, there's more girls than grains of sand out there. I can't keep track of them all. I hate to be you if we find out you're lying! <laughs> I truly hope nothing happens to your precious Figaro! 
If I didn't know any better, that would have been a threat. Say that guy's missing a few buttons. This terror. Take her to a room. I'd love to chat with you, but I must plan a strategy with the Chancellor and my advisors. Being a king is not all tea and crumpets, if you'll excuse me. Why are all the men consorting against the woman? She could have ran out of this castle right now and rejoined the Empire. Probably not the best idea. Granted. Oh, there's sand in my boots. That's what that one Chocobo was saying about it. There's sand on my boots. He wears boots, too. Don't worry about a thing. I'll... You look right. Edgar told me about you. Is it true you're a thief? No, I stole those things. They're, they're treasure hunter. On the outside, Edgar pretends to support the Empire. The truth is, he's collaborating with the Returners. An organization opposed to the Empire. I'm his contact with that group. The old man you met in Narsh is one of us. Not anymore! It's, wow, I I, I... I... I chose that one wisely, huh? I'm using you. Things are different now. Whenever I try to think, my head hurts even worse. I can't tell you what to do. But you're gonna have to follow the prod. It's in the, the, the prod. The prod? It's in the script. Telly not locking the door, by the way. I'm locking the door. In I'm standing. If you get it, you, Tara, you get it? I'm standing in front of the door. I locked the door. Get it? No? Oh no! Something terrible happened to Figaro! How could this have happened? What's happening? It's the Empire, it's Kefka! What are you doing? Sizing each other up again. The awkward changes between player control and not player control. Fire, fire! <laughs> fire, fire! This is Beavis and Butthead. This is this is his two guards, Beavis and Butthead. <laughs> Fire. <laughs> Bring me the girl now. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, they lit a building primarily out of stone on fire. That's impressive. And metal. How? Uh, magic? No. Wait. They don't. Only Terra. And welcome to my barbecue. <laughs> Jerk. I'm gonna shoot you with an auto crossbow later. Bring me the girl now! Bring me the girl now! At least do something besides running around. What do I pay you people for? Edgar, you don't really pay us. We're kind of like vassals. Get ready! Yes, sir! Chainsaw. Changed your mind? Because I have no choice. Yeah, Chocobo said rescue! Or maybe I do! I'm gonna let my castle burn! Oh my! The brave and noble king abandons his people to save his own skin! How utterly delightful! <laughs> Jump! Okay, dive! Dive now! Dive? What? Yahoo! Whoopee! Waha! Mo 
Mamma mia! Kind of looks like Golden Chocobo. Well, then you know, he's a king and, uh... He could breed lots of those things. Behold the glory of Figaro as she dives into the greatest golden ocean. No one can touch the people of Figaro. Wait, close the hatch, close the hatch. No, oh, sand is everywhere. Oh, no, oh. Oh, this is going to take years to get out. They dive now? They dive now. They dive now. Go kill them. Oh, chocobos are not faster. Terra's like, hey, I remember these things. Oh, poisona is cure poison. It's not make poison. Shoot crossbow. Edgar's the artificer. He could. Uh, oh, right, they witnessed magic. Edgar, what's the matter? You look positively spooked. Did you just see what I saw? Yeah, she does that. She's amazing! I always loved the design of these M-Tech armor uh, battle sprites. Yeah, they are pretty good, aren't they? That was magic! Magic! Mag magic! She was magic? I thought it was some kind of parlor trick. What is this cat doing here now? Edgar, where in the world did you learn that? Magic gear. Oh, I, I wouldn't want to use this voice on luck. But I think I know the perfect character for magic gear. Sorry, I, uh, um... Did, did, did anybody realize we're in the middle of a boss fight? Right? Just uh, the Kermit the Frog soldiers are just gonna sit there. Okay. Look, I didn't mean to make a big, such a big deal out of this. Me neither. It's just that I've never actually seen magic before. I love how all the Magitech armors are just sitting there letting this conversation happen. <laughs> Frankly, I just wanted to set them on fire. I forgot about this part. It's their turn. We'll get ours soon. It's our turn. We'll get ours soon. They look like Kermits. Edgar, Terra can use mad can use magic, and we can't. That's the only difference between us. Fact is, we could use our help. Thank you, Luck. Thank you, Edgar. Now let's get back into battle. Come on. Oh no, quicksand! Stop swooning. Yeah, I got your potion. You got any of that cure magic, by the way? I'm getting annihilated out here. Isn't there like a rare thing you can steal off these guys? I could have sworn there's a rare. Okay, never mind, you're dead. Bravo, Figaro! Now let's just run around in circles and make Kefka confused. Son of a submariner! What the heck is that line? Let me look at the script real Really? Ah. You'll pay for this! Son of a submariner, what were they reading? What were they writing during this? What? Is that an, an evil person? I'm, I'm scared. Terra, it is someone you I'd like you to meet. Our members of the Returners. Our leader, Bannon, would certainly like to meet you. Magic's going to be key to winning this war. Give me a second.
Okay, I'm back. Oh. Peaked it a little bit too hard there. Magic. Terra has magical powers that Esper seemed to react to her. Can there be some connection? What Esper? Did I skip something? Uh, oh, she probably told the story about the Tritok. Man, with the foggiest, these powers just come naturally to me. No human is born with the powers you seem to have, and... Oh. Oh, uh, that's probably the wrong thing to say right now. We're trying to escape, Terra? Chocos are just like, why does this drama have to happen now? Aren't they in a hurry somewhere? What should I do? I'm sure the Empire is gonna come after you. To get their hands on you again, the world's finished. Terra, you wanna understand your own powers, right? And I think we need to consult with the Bannon. He will help you find the truth. Please. Okay, to the south, there's a cave that leads to South Figaro. We were gonna call it North Figaro. Oh, we're not gonna get the cho- No? No, we don't get the- No, no, Terra's doing a sad. We can't- Oh. Well. Well. Now we jump off of our chocobos, all of us. Come on, get off. The, get off them. They have, they have places to be too. They got families. I was trying to move forward, and I was going. To, I the, the button that I hit was get off the chocobo button, and that's it. I really should have bought those things for Edgar when I had the chance, but, uh, Edgar ca Edgar's castle is currently on a fire. Hey, can I borrow one of those? No. Where are you headed, sire? To the cave in Eastwood to South Figaro, which is now at the east. It will make for the returners hideout in the north. Turn to the castle and pass word along. See, see he knows he knows how to how would I possibly know how to drive chocobos? I am chocobos. I don't drive them. I like the random turtle. Random turtle, just in the middle of nowhere. Foppers. Foppers and you rock. I wonder if it's a rock type. Ew, what did it just do? Ew, ew. That was weird. It just like, it glommed me. As long as Locke's in the party, I might as well try to steal off. Okay, never mind. Just, like, get free stuff, you know. That's what Locke's all about, free stuff. I just don't know if what enemies are valuable for steel, because I use steel so infrequently. That I don't know what the, where the target should be. What should I commit my stealing to? I should look that up before the next stream. Need to get him some stealing gloves so he doesn't fail. So it tells me by this point I should have like the broken Genji glove or something. Let's see, hold two weapons. That'd be great. I thought you could get it early. Unless we have tons of potions that I'm not going to use.
really should have bought those uh, those other things so we had more gadgets to use. I don't know how long it's going to be until we go back to Figaro Castle. Or if they even sell the things anywhere else. Fire all and auto crossbow just shreds these guys. It's a good thing that's exactly what we have. Literally the only AoE we have. Really just gotta bash the A button over and over again. Hoping they die. Okay, I see the door there. Look, I see the door there. Really? We can run. It seems to be taking... There we go. Final Fantasy VI. You'll get sick of the battles. But you'll stay for everything else. Oh, oh that was an all-fire. Oh, no. Oh, no, I grumped it. why Edgar is so powerful, though. Fire 178. He almost does that to everybody. Oh no, sleep! I don't think that persists after battles. I hope not. Are we done with the tutorial yet? I feel like we're still in tutorial mode. Bill Moldar is the name of this creature. But row? I didn't want to row. I'm just gonna take a step back. I don't know if Locke was successful on that steal. I'll try again. It doesn't have anything. Boy, it smells like broken here! This makes this high. Back here. I know crossbows are best bet for this. Terra, no! Your journey has ended here. Terra died in a tragic lightning accident. Something looks a little different with Tingling Ring. Well, that's because Tingling Ring is on Saturday, and today's Thursday. So today is Final Fantasy VI. I don't want to use any Phoenix Downs. But I got them for free, it's like piracy. Now, this is the accessory shop, if I'm not mistaken. Equip relics! These double my walking speed! Oh, we can do that normally. He tried to do a Pepino. Alex, give you your party members a variety of abilities. For example, Sprint Shoes will double your walking speed. Knight's Coat lets you use shield on this darn battle. Dragoon Boots allow you to do jump, jump attacks. Gauntlet lets you hold a weapon with both hands. Thanks, Mog. So respects. Knight's Code, Jewel Ring. Jewel Ring is, um... Poison, I think. We don't need to sprint shoes ever. Oh, Star Pendant is Poison. Jewel Ring, Petrification. And Darkness. We don't need these, because I can just hold the B button on the Uncensored Edition. And I can do the same thing. You'll always see me moving at sprint shoot speed. At least it's not 80 gil per night. Also, wasn't a GP in the original SNES? That was another translation thing they had to fix. Also, another point of contrition. Jill or gil? Hello there! 
castle stood up to the Empire. Now we'll be all drawn into battle. Yes, it's tragic. It's terrible. It's like what's going on here. If I was a worm, would you still love me? And are you in love with the fish also? Is this anything like the PlayStation version I played? I believe the spring shoes stack with your dash button. Hmm. Well, I mean, we could do a science. We could do a science. And find out. I can always sell them later if I don't want them. Relic. Okay. This is with the- uh, Oh my goodness! Um, yeah, they stack. They, they definitely stack. Also, Gil, as like the G in Go. I put the roller skates on my boots! Yeah, the, the, the heck with it. We're gonna give you some spring shoes. I... Oh. I love this part. At the very least, he could give me a response. Stand back. He seems vaguely familiar. Edgar invented Heelys. Wait a minute. He comes and goes like the wind, swearing allegiance to no one. Behind his wintry gaze hides a face known to no one who lives. Shadow. I want to test something. I want to test something. Would this work? No? Ah, man. There's no way to put a space in there, right? No. I could have sworn... I played Final Fantasy VI once just for the funnies and I was able to put in... nothing. I mean, I could do this. I could do that. I guess we'll go with Shadow. I wanted to name him... I mean, Live Alive let me. Live Alive officially better than Final Fantasy VI. And Shadow, he's an assassin. I hear he'd slit his mama's throat for a nickel. Actually, it was for a dime. Better steer clear of him, I guess. Edgy the Hedgy. Ah. Leave us. The dog eats strangers. I tried to raise it as a husky. And now it has an anger issue. Hmm, I wonder if that has something to do with Sabin. No, it isn't. Hey, make sure you, do, you don't forget about Shadow now, because uh, Shadow's the cool ninja guy. It's the 90s. Cool ninja does the cool ninja stuff, and he ninjas people in the face. So you, know, you, better, you better not get ninjaed by him. What's the even point of being back here? Oh. Oh, free stuff? Don't mind if I do. Where are we going? Where are you going? That seems like a very impractical way to get around in this town. I hope that's not a normal thing. I think I accidentally a secret shortcut. Is this the place where the, the, the dude has the paintings? I don't think this is the place the dude has the paintings. And it's later. Give me some. I don't have run. Fetch quests, really? Let me read the tag on the shoes. It says, Haunted by the Spirit of a Blue Hedgehog. 
So that's why I feel like I gotta, yeah, gotta go fast. Too fast, cool. Chili dog. I spit all over my microphone. Oh, did you just shoot them with a crossbow and set them on fire? It seems to work. Duncan, the world famous martial artist. Except on Mount Colts. And they have a save point in the basement. Wow. I didn't save. I didn't save for like almost an hour. That would have been terrible if something bad would have happened. When do we see a chocobo? Oh, uh, we already had that, actually, and, um... I told them, go free, brother! Run free! Don't look back! It was totally not an accident, it was intentional. Use your legs. It's the reason why they're underneath you. Humans. Stupid... Keep... It's animal slavery. It's animal slavery. You're not allowed to do that. They're people too, you know. So I let them free in, th in the desert. His instincts will kick in. He'll find food out there. There's scorpions to eat. Yay, more weapons. And the noise blaster and bio blaster I didn't pick up. I should at least get, um... Get Terra and lock something, because D Edgar is going to be mostly using his tools anyway. Thick, broad-bladed sword. Perfect for the girl. And one for lock. Run free Chocobo, and then it gets eaten by a monster. A purple worm jumps out and eats him. Somebody's gonna get the Genji Glove, I tell you what. I tell you ha what. Extra thick. The sword is extra thick. Shield for Terra. Get her a headband, too. Two hat. I still have money, wow. Usually, early Final Fantasies leave you, like, broke for, like, most of the game. Yeah, hairband. Oh, I thought Hairband improves, like, magical damage. Oh well. She could be magically resistant. Zoom! Zoom! In case you're bored of the town. I've activated my Heelys. It's a new invention. It'll really take off. Get it? Take off. I wonder where this mountain thing is. I, I kind of want to go to the mountain now. Go to Mount Calm. Isn't there like a map you could look at? Um. Oh! Th th oh! That was reverse. I thought they was doing something weird. Now we just got that map. Unfortunately, the boots don't work on the overworld. And we've got a lot better gear now. We've got the noise blaster, which um, I'm not quite sure what it does. I think it's just confusion. Really? Get air horned. 
That lightning is brutal! And just realize Chocobo is actually playing a Final Fantasy. Um, 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 this is Earthbound. It just looks different because we heavily modded it. I think this is Mount Calm. Okay, it's Mount Nothing. It's Mount Butt Smell. We don't talk about that one. How about how about we don't? I'm not quite sure why people stopped the running. This is Figaro Cave, right? Yeah. I want to go to a mountain and learn Kung Fu! Is the, the only monster in this area just this guy? We have a Belmodar infestation. Ah yes, the single crop of cabbage and turnip are doing quite well. What's that smell? It smells like cabbage and turnip. This is favorite tea. His favorite potion. He loves to keep it in a bucket. These dishes, they were his favorites. This bed smells like him. Wait, uh, what? Okay. I didn't want to do that, but uh, Edgar got seepy all of a sudden. It's just the same one every time chasing you down for a rematch. <laughs> Ironically, Mount Butt Smell looks a more like a foot. I will sleep in all the beds. One was too soft, one was too hard, but the last bed was just right. And then Goldly Edgar, uh, slept with some ladies. The end. Could Sabin be living here? Hello, random old man that came out of nowhere. I live in the well. I happen to know where I could find a man who lives here. Gus, he left a couple days ago after he heard Master Duncan was slain. He headed to the mountains. I heard Duncan's son Vargas is missing as well. I have a bad feeling about this. Narcolepsy. <laughs> Whenever I see a bed, I just get really eepy. So where is the mountain? Computer, generate Mount Tame. Oh, here we go. The first official dungeon, I think. Zoom! I thought that said Chirpius for a second, but there's no H in there. It's Kirpius. I think Bioblaster will do very effectively on this mountain. Try not to breathe in. And now we eat them. We just shot them with poison. I don't know. I don't know about that. I saw that treasure chest. I means to get it. Eh, hey, it'll cook out. We're kung fu guys. We're just kung fu in. I wonder what kind of kung fu they're learning on this mountain. Because I like to think it's uh, David Carradine's weird scam that he got into for a little while where he just had a stick and he was just like twirling it in his hands and just like you're like struggling with the stick you're like spinning it around in your hands and stuff he called it spiral energy 
That's a real thing. Red Letter Media covered it. Wait, are they healing off the poison? They shouldn't be! That's the power of spiral energy. To heal from poison. You just twirl the stick around and the poison no longer hurts. Red Letter Media had a video of it. And they were making fun of it. Oh hey, I forgot about that shield. You might want this. Also, can you hold shield? Yeah. You should have a shield. And I think... Yeah, this is better for you. Spiral energy. Gurren Lagan would like to know your location. The funny thing is, David Carradine's video on spiral energy never really mentions it as a product. It's just... They just talk about spiral energy. And twirling the stick. And doing whatever you want with it. You just do whatever you want with your stick. If I could shoot a deer with a poison arrow in Skyrim, it'd be fine. It should be fine here. But what if it's just the simple fact that it has an arrow stuck in it is the why it's died, and the poison didn't have time to work yet? How long does something have to be poisoned before the meat is considered tainted? Terry, you're the only one with like an on-demand heal, so uh, you're gonna have to do all the healing work. Twirling the stick sounds dirty. Well, considering if you know your history about David Carradine... It's not too far from the truth. Just called Terra Terry. Wow, there's another side of the mountain! And Tina would be more accurate. How about T? I pity the fool! Does a color T. Stop doing 30 damage. Jeez. We only have like 190 to begin with. Oh boy, potions. I love potions. I love tent. Now we can throw it at somebody and the snake will bite them and poison them, right? Uh, oh, 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 it's, uh, that, that's three Final Fantasies from now, never mind. How about we call her friend? I don't know. She was working, did you know she was working with the Empire? Miss nice Perry. Wait a second, what was a wild animal doing with a potion anyway? Hold up a second, I don't think this game follows reality very much. Excuse me, sirs. 1994 needs to go back to the drawing board, I don't think this works logically. You're just now figuring that out? For the bit. Figured it out for the bit. So it was that guy from Star Wars, and he was a friend. Yeah, but she didn't have her Lando Calrissian moment yet. Speaking of which, Edgar... Edgar pretends that he's on the good guy side, the, the bad guy side too, so, uh, you know... The only person we can really trust here is the thief... Uh, treasure... Adventurer. Thief Treasure Venture. Wow, he really can move. The spiral energy is really working out for him. For a second, I saw Terra on the left and thought she turned on the party. Brown sp sprites on a brown back road do doesn't really work. A 
poison in the chicken. Yes, treasure hunter. He, he doesn't have the hat, he doesn't wear enough green, he uses daggers instead of a whip, so we can't really... We can't really call him an archaeologist now, can we? I don't think he's been approved by the Academy. Uh, SNES and the graphics glitching out when things like this happen. Watch it again. Joy! We need to get my boy. We got some Trillium here! It's overgrowing on this mountain. I bet it's weak against fire. Speaking of which, I need- oh no, poison! And if you look here for one frame, El Edgar turns into an Eldritch Abomination. Okay, I'm pretty sure I need to cure that. I think that persists. Yeah, that's persisting. Poisona! have many ethers, but it's enough. And definitely cannot a thief like my character in Skyrim who has tomb who was a Tomb Raider. He certainly did not get knotted by a th thief. I didn't say anything. Did you ever have things just randomly go through your brain and then out your mouth without really felt? <laughs> I worry about your mental health, AC. <laughs> Let's just say that Locke got into some very situ interesting situations, especially with all the furry races in this game. Let's just say that. I think that's easier to say. Sometimes you just gotta play, pay some lip, lip service, you know? The life of a treasure hunter is a hard one. Okay, well now, what am I supposed to- that made my eyes hurt. I'm gonna need some brain bleach by the end of the stream series, huh? Uh... Maybe? I'm, I'm not sure why you would need brain bleach. Please let Terra heal before they attack again. Judging you harshly. You can judge all you want, it ain't gonna unspeak the words. Just say I've been around on the internet for at least 28 years. You see things. And sometimes you wish you haven't. You know things. It's it's like it's like Cthulhu. You learn things and it stays in your brain, even though you don't want it there. That's how the internet works. Ah, come on, the boss is right there. The boss is right there! This encounter rate is quite silly. Terra books it out of here. See you later, losers. I'm gonna have to use. Uh, I'm gonna have to use one of my potions. No. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, no, the potions. I'm hoarding them. Sabbath say you're right. Rude. Are you? Sabin, is he here? Terra's just dead? Oh, okay, never mind. We're shadowing us earlier, right? The hell are you talking about? <laughs> Doesn't matter who you are, I will not surrender. What was the day you met me? 
You'll be the last day of your lives! Okay, did you talk to everybody like that, sir? Where did you bring the bears? Sir, you're not allowed to have bears here! I can't even target Vargas. It won't let me. Is that called... are they poos? They're called poos. I poo! Dude, I watch commentary videos. I've seen things. So then you know! Then you know! These bears don't have anything. How? Go for the guy with low health. Sure you do. That's exactly what you do. Because the computer just sort of knows sometimes. Kung Fu Bears, what is this? Mr. Pandaria? I had I had a I had a Pandaren monk. Whose name was Cacho Arino. He was a um, brew brewmaster. I went back into World of Warcraft for Legion, and then when I finished Legion, I went back out. The dragons couldn't bring me back in. Oh, can I steal from you now? I would like to steal from you. You look like a person that has stuff. Oh boy, a potion! Come on, what's the matter? I hit girls! That's how evil I am. Then take you for the tank type. I I also played a Pharaoh Druid before that. Long before that. That's when they had tanks that were fun, because you could also be a DPS. Give me your stuff. Enough! Off with you now. I've chosen to end this battle. Give it up, Vargas. So you've come, Salmon. Why, Vargas? What? Why did you kill Master Duncan? Your own father? Stunt me, his only son. He chose you as his successor. And look how tall I am! What the heck is going on here? The guy's like 20 feet tall. That's not true. Master, you lie, it's written all over your face. You wanted you to be the success and not me. You knew you had the most potential. Enough of your lies. Have a taste of my superior technique. Mortal Attack Blizzard Fist, it's now an anime. This man is not evil, not even Kiryu would hit a girl. Oh, this man is evil, not even Kiryu would hit a girl. That, okay, that made more sense. Ha, ah, Sabin, the master taught you well. Uh, I guess there's no avoiding this. I somehow lost my Chad voice from, uh... From, uh, Little Gator Game. Fate made us train together, and fate will send you to your doom. Wait, he he dying now. Don't don't How am I going to blitz when you didn't even teach me how to blitz? You didn't teach me blitz. I forgot all the inputs for uh for Sabin's Blitzes. I think Forward Back might be one, but I'm not exactly sure when to uh, input it. Quarter Circle Forward Punch? Or maybe this is just a boss battle and we're not meant to win. I, I think... I think that was not... Oh. I, I have a button for this.
There we go. Sam is supposed to win this fight somehow. Without knowing anything about his blitzes. Taught you about his blitz before they, they throw the throw you into a fight with him. It's weird. To, I don't remember this part at all. I could have sworn this game gives you gives you at least a chance to use a blitz. Time to put it into this. That's his teachings. Let's use a blitz technique. Oh, finally, it's teaching me. Choose blitz. Left, right, left, A. Oh, that's what I'm missing. That's the A button. When the cursor appears, use your technique. Choose that with my mind. So left, right, left, A. There we go. Punch. What the? He, he already taught you that? Really been in such a rush for power. Wow, he one punch man the guy. Big brother? That weird guy? The brothers are united! Where's brother? First glance, I thought he was some bodybuilder restrained from his gym. He's built like a bear! Built like a bear? I'll take that as a compliment. Anyway, brother, what are you doing here? On our way to the Saber Mountains. Oh, no, wait, that was, that was Edgar. The Returners had it, right? I've been watching from afar, hoping that the world might regain some sanity. Ninja Dude next. I kind of ran across the ninja guy already. He threatened to kill us if we pet his dog. This way, I was afraid Figaro would be reduced to a puppet state. Yeah, I read books. I don't just lift them. The time to strike back has arrived. Empire's gonna pay for what he's done. I'm no longer their lapdog. Think a bear like me could help you in your fight? You join us, Simon? I think Duncan would rest easy if he knew his disciple played a part in bringing peace to the world. Well then, let's get going! Now we got the monk! And yeah, this is a pretty good setup. We got a divine soul sorceress. We got um, a, a rogue fighter. We got a, a, an artificer. And we got a monk. Raging Fist. Left, right. Left, right, left. Ara Cannon. That's one of my favorites, even though it's hard to input on a D-pad. It's like... I think it's down, down, right, right, A. That's kind of how the input goes. And a Meteor Suplex. X, Y, down, up. I was joking about the quarter circle. You forgot about the quarter circle? It's a traditional Hadouken! Here we go. Zoom! I 
I haven't actually played six myself. Oh. Oh, okay then. What was it? X, Y, down, up. I want to do it on one of these weird critters. Um, X, Y, down, up. I hope I got the right buttons. Nope! It's the other way around. It's the other way around. Don't defend. You know what? Just die. Just everything die. I'm gonna suplex something. I'm going to suplex something today! By the way, Meteor Suplex is Suplex. I gotta Suplex something before I end the stream tonight. Right. I think it's X, Y, down, up, A. Let's see if that works. No! Maybe I'm not doing it fast enough. Let's defend everybody. There we go. The X is on the top button on my controller. It's in the contract. There we go. The contract has been achieved. But I also want to shoot a laser at somebody. So, down, down, right, right, A. Oh! Oh, it doesn't work this time around, I guess. Or maybe it's down, right, down, right. Right down, right, A. Nope, you really have to do the diagonal. I could have sworn there was a way around that. It's down, down, right, right, A. The stream will not end until something's escorted to Suplex City. Well, the stream can end. It's just I also want to shoot a laser. Down, down, right, right, A. Oh, I'm doing. I'm, I'm taking. I'm taking right as in towards the enemy. That's what I'm doing wrong here. I'm putting in down left. Down, down, right, right, A. No. I just want to shoot one Kamehameha! The only meme I know from this game comes from Suplex to Train. Yeah, that meme's in there. And you know I'm gonna be Suplexing that train. You know what? I'm tired of them existing. Suplex. What?! Sabin, you can't grab a squirrel and suplex it? What's wrong with you? I can't really figure out the input on that. Suplex is better anyway. Suplex is better anyway. I'll figure it out next time. Suplex. Everybody's getting sup- Everybody's getting suplex today! At least I get a lot of practice inputting suplex. I, I think you can't suplex them because they're in the ground. I think that's what's happening here. Because I think it's considered like an earth-based attack. Yeah, we can't suplex them. They're already in the ground. That's what I think anyway. I suplexed that one dude. I'm gonna have to figure out how to input Meteor Aura. Like, how would they expect you to do that with a D-pad? And not to have it be like a fighting game. Or a cannon. Down, down, left... Well, I tried down, down, left, left. That certainly did not work. get to the next town. I'll, uh, you know what? I'll get to here. I'll continue Final Fantasy VI from here next Thursday. But uh, I think we made a, quite a bit of progress. I think we did a bit of progress. We got the suplex! 
We got the suplex. Now I'm just having to figure out how the aura thing works. Did you roll it like a normal fighting game, or are you just doing indiv individual inputs? Um, I tried the individual inputs first, because I could have sworn the game accepts it when you do that. No, I didn't roll it. I kinda... I'm gonna try rolling it. Let's get into battle. Come on, does somebody wanna do it? Yeah. Now let's try rolling it. There we go! Yeah, you roll it. You roll it forward towards the enemy. There we go! I had ukened. I know Kung Fu! Alright, Saturday. Saturday will be Tingling Ring. And Thursday will be more of this. Until either this or Tingling Ring is done, then I'll find out what to do next. I do want to mention that uh, I did get a hold of Ori in the Blind Forest Definitive Edition, Ori the Will of the Wisps, and Backpack Hero. They had a sale on Steam today, and I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'll pick those up. So maybe one of these days we'll do an Ori. We'll do the Ori games. I also want to do Metal Gear. And by the time this is done, I could do um, I could do Earthbound Randomizer, the same thing I do every year. So I got a lot of plans, even though it's going back to normal stream schedule now. We pizza the tower, we fashioned the police, and now we will final the fantasy. Good night, everybody.